When we watch a futuristic movie, we all think how future will look like, what will change on our personal lives, our transport, our health, or even what will change socially. Well, these are difficult questions to answer, and what we can and will do is to see what experts of each area think that will happen. So today we're going to see how future will look like according to experts and their views on the subject. Leave a like and follow me, every Thursday you'll have a new video and every day you'll have amazing content on my Instagram, you'll have the link in the description. Well, let's start with predictions about the world's population. According to a United Nations prediction, in 2050 world's population will be around 9.7 billion people and just 50 years later will be around 11 billion people and that will lead us into a growth of all human needs, that's obvious, food, water, healthcare, but let's see. Well, let's start with healthcare. In 24 it will probably be rare to be in the presence of a doctor. You will have online support, which will free hospitals and avoiding hours of waiting. In my opinion, Covid accelerated the process. And of course, AI is a booming field and it will revolutionize the industry in multiple ways. Specific types of AIs might be trained assistants overseeing operations. I know, it seems kinda creepy. Consumer facing AIs will help you to navigate the healthcare system. AI will even help to develop researches and new treatments and technologies for organ and tissue regeneration are being developed and that would be an amazing step to healthcare well and what about the jobs which ones are going to disappear and which ones are coming well let's start with the ones that probably are going to disappear in a close future the first one is a travel agent i think that nowadays you can just compare prices on a lot of intuitive websites and save a lot of money during the process and of course a mail carrier well, this one is pretty obvious, it will disappear, nowadays it's hard to see someone sending a letter. The next one is a fast food cook. To operate with lower costs, automation should be the next step to this industry. The next one is sports referee. If you enjoy sports, you probably know this already. In football, just to give you an example, FIFA is using a new system called Video Assistant Referee. I'm a football fan and I don't like it very much, but it looks like it's here to stay. Now let's take a look at new careers. You could work as an esports coach for example. Just like a traditional sports coach, he works on his team but in gaming area. It could be really exhausting mentally. The next one is a software developer. This job is already on our society but in the future will be a lot more. Basically develops software to clients, recommends upgrades and give you what you ask with all the pieces together. The next one is a data analyst. It's basically someone who scrutinizes information, identifies trends to reach better results. And then we have a user experience designer. This person is basically responsible for giving the best customer experience possible. Make your own research, but if you're willing to put hard work on some of these, you could make a lot of money. Now let's talk a little bit about transportation. You're probably thinking about flying cars. Yep, they will exist. Nobody gave a specific date, but there are prototypes already. People in 2025 will be driven around in driverless pods. By 2040, it will be possible to ride in an hypersonic jet. Just to give you a perspective, you could even go from London to New York in just one hour. And last but not least, you'll be able to ride an hyperloop by 2025. It will reach the speed around 500 miles an hour. Well, socially after Covid, things are going in ways that we never thought they would. Experts predict that shared struggles and experience that we face through the pandemic could foster solidarity and bring us closer together, globally. A polarization decline will probably happen. Peter Coleman, a professor of psychology at Columbia University mentions that the main reason to this prediction is that we're facing a common enemy and that is bringing people together. Covid really made an impact in the world and a lot of changes are already happening. In politics, according to some studies, electronic voting is going mainstream. And if we look back to 1918 to 1919, after the Spanish flu and the end of World War One, people wanted carefree entertainment and the introduction of cars and radio facilitated that. And the economy recovered faster. To end this video we have to make some predictions about AI, I think that's pretty obvious. Well firstly you'll probably see autonomous cars as I said before. AI will work alongside humans to perform tasks on manufacturing for example. On healthcare AI will help doctors to diagnose diseases faster and accurately. Virtual nursing assistants will help to create a more personalized patient experience and that's a massive help. Google for example is already working on an AI assistant that 
that can place human-like calls to make appointments. Even education will benefit from it. AI assistants will help human instructors to determine who needs help or not. These were just a few examples about AI, I could make a whole video about this subject. If you would like to see a video about AI, tell me on the comments or on Instagram. To be honest, I would love to do it. For now, I finished my video here. I really hope you enjoyed it. This was Successology here. You'll never be average again. Peace.